first of the three series of International Tennis Federation World Tour Juniors, J30, is taking place at the tennis section of the Mashud Abiola Stadium. Correspondent Jane Francis on Wednesday profiles one of the players, Grace Chungweke. The International Tennis Federation Walter Juniors J30 Abuja commenced on Sunday 28th of May at the tennis section of the Mushida Viola National Stadium. Nigerian players will be slogging it out with other international players from five different countries. One of the players that easily captures attention is Nigerian-born British junior tennis player Grace Chimwinke, who is desirous of having a great career in tennis. 13-year-old Chimike, who started her career in the racket sports at the age of nine, considers that as a late start, but she has risen to the third round under 14 player in England. I started like when I was eight and a half on going on to nine, so I was like a pretty late starter. Um, so it has been like very tough because especially from where I am in the UK, the competition's really tough and it took some time for me to really break through, you know, um, but, you know, with hard work and putting your mind into it, time, effort, and yeah, it's paid off, so, yeah. She has had bouts of injury concern recently, but participated in Le Petit AS 2023 before signing up for the J30 Abuja. Chiwige is tutored by Lawn Tennis Association accredited coach Justin Shering and player coach Martin Shivnov. She's committed to improving her game by adopting the styles of her role model in the sport. Like Serena Williams. Um, at the moment, I really like Irina Sabalenka. Um, I just like her because like, she's a powerful player and I like powerful players because I also consider myself a pretty aggressive player. So, you know, I look up to aggressive players and stuff, but yeah. Okay, so, uh... Aside from leaving in England where she's exposed to standard training facilities, Jimmy K's parents are also a major support system. My mom definitely, my mom takes me everywhere. <laughs> she's everywhere with me, you know, also my dad, you know, just helps me mentally and stuff and like he's just always available and stuff and I just like call him up and tell him like, hey, I'm struggling with this, I'm nervous and he just kind of mentally helps me and then obviously the side of my mom, she's always with me, she takes me everywhere and stuff so she helps me a lot with that because also not a lot of parents would like dedicate their whole life to this and basically my mom has done that, you know, I go training with her every day and she takes me to tournaments and stuff so I'm basically with my mom for like the whole time. It's, it's something that I think she loves and then... Um... She didn't start with tennis. She, she, I think she started very late, uh, almost when she was nine. She just saw it on television and then she said she wants to play. And we thought it's just something and she just fell in love with it. And then uh, since then, then she, 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 she's been playing and she loved the game. She loved to compete, even though it's tough. So some days it's, it's, it's hard, very hard, but she keep going. That, that's what it's all about. While demonstrating her ability and capacity to be a successful professional in the future, at the ITF World Tours Junior in Abuja, Chiwike harbors the dream of one day playing at Wimbledon. A Grand Slam. I have two. Okay, so either Wimbledon or US Open. Um, obviously, Wimbledon's my home. <laughs> Oh, but, you know, I really love the US Open. But obviously, Wimbledon's really special, you know. It's a grass tournament, home is big, you know, and the trophy's beautiful. <laughs> um, but definitely, um, I would definitely love to play at the US Open, be playing finals there on centre court, and just have the crowd cheering and stuff, and, like, the great atmosphere and stuff, but, yeah. Jimmy Kay is currently ranked 1,701 in the world, with a career best ranking of 1,644. She has played eight tournaments, finishing twice in the semi final before entering the J30 Abuja. Jane Francis Mweze, TVC News, Abuja.